coach's profiles, Mario Tremblay. Mario Tremblay is one of the worst coaches in Montreal Canadiens history. In this episode, I take a deeper look at the coach career of Mario Tremblay. Tremblay was hired four games into the 1995-96 season as head coach of the Canadiens, although he had no previous coaching experience. As coach, he developed a long-running dispute with star goaltender Patrick Wall, which eventually led to Wall's departure from Montreal. The two almost came to blows in a Long Island coffee shop before Tremblay was announced as head coach. They almost fought for a second time after Tremblay fired a shot at Wall's throat during practice. The breaking point was when Tremblay kept Patrick Wall in net in a game versus the Detroit Red Wings on December 2nd, 1995. The Wings scored 9 goals on Wall who was jeered by the Montreal fans. Wall stormed off the ice and told team president Ronald Curry it was his last game in Montreal. Four days later, Wall was traded to the Colorado Avalanche. Wall would go on to win two Stanley Cups with the Avalanche. Tremblay also had a heated verbal exchange with Montreal enforcer Donald Brashear. This caused Brashear to be traded to the Vancouver Canucks. As head coach of the Canadians, Tremblay coached 159 games. He had a 71, 63, and 25 record in two seasons with the team. Even though Mario Tremblay only coached the Montreal Canadiens for two seasons, he caused enough damage to last a decade. This is why Mario Tremblay is considered one of the worst coaches in franchise history. Next on Coaches Profiles, Barry Melrose.